Hello and welcome RC Shim on the flight field, Molderam. Where it is possible to fly these things because of limitations in airspace and so forth. Frankly, the largest copter that I've ever seen, the largest drone. Radar, whatnot, flies 20 to 40 minutes depending on configuration and weight. It has a winch system, it can go for 16 kilometers of range. It can be folded like your Mavic, it's a bit heavier than your Mavic, 33 kilograms and almost 66 kilograms with the two packs. 38 amp hours <laughs> and 52 volts. Massive packs, two of them. Could also be hot swap, I need to turn off the drone. This Tupperware box is the parachute. You can deploy the parachute with the press of a button on the remote, but only once obviously. Or it will do it on its own if it detects certain weird movements. If it thinks it needs it, it will deploy it. I'm not sure if it saves itself from damage, but it of course will save other people or property from being damaged by such a heavy thing falling just out of the air. RTK for more precision. Another radar to scan the terrain. Of course those fat props need fat motors. <laughs> and fat motors rely on beefy ESCs, these things here, and obstacle sensors and whatnot. Currently in winch mode. It looks a bit weird from this <laughs> angle though. <laughs> Sounds amazing on the heavy duty and you will hear the relief when he lands the freight and also you see when he touches down the power consumption goes from over 50 to 25 percent on the upper left side. And that's the other cool thing, if your freight sways back and forth, the craft will control the swing and counteract it. And it's the weight we lifted. Let's see some more air-to-air -air footage. My drone is bigger than your drone. <laughs> <laughs> 